You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. So we got to come to Hindman Settlement School today to celebrate AT&T delivering 75 free laptops to the students in the summer program here. And so um, there were uh, 50 that were going to um, younger kids, like middle school-ish age, and 25 going to high school students. AT&T's $2 billion three-year commitment aims to address the digital divide by providing resources and connectivity to underserved communities across the country. These are laptops, 75 of them, that are going to be used by these students who participate in these programs, and they can take them home. Uh, so digital inclusion is about access, about affordability, but also about adoption and having the tools to be able to navigate the online world. Speaking at the event, Lieutenant Governor Coleman emphasized the significance of this initiative, stating we are all still working hard to bring hope and opportunity here. I think everyone knows that uh, you know, there are lots of challenges that people in Eastern Kentucky face, and it's really been uh, amplified by the, the flood that occurred a year ago. Uh, and so we're just really trying to uh, you know, help children to have the same tools and the same opportunities that children anywhere else in the country might have. And providing them with a laptop like this is really one of the ways that we can help do that. To see the looks on their faces and to have so many of those kids say, I've never had a computer before, this is my first computer, uh, tells you how important it is, but also the connectivity that it's going to teach them about with internet access. The responsibility now they have to take care of this device is uh, even more important, I think, in, in some ways. Well, I came to school really not knowing really much that this was going to happen. But all of a sudden, I, and someone said it, and then, and then I was very happy, which I, this is late in the day, so I can't wait to actually get this. The laptops distributed during the event will not only assist students in their summer reading programs, but will also enable participants in the creative writing program to enhance their skills and unleash their creativity. I'm just so proud of Governor Bashir's uh, commitment to continue to be an education first administration. And what the pandemic taught us more than anything was uh, uh, the importance of connectivity and how much we depended on it as students, as employees. Uh, and so we wanna make sure that we bring that access all across Kentucky. So we actually established the very first office of broadband that Kentucky's ever had for the purpose of continuing to deploy funds that we, that we receive from the federal government for uh, increasing our connectivity all across Kentucky. Our goal is to bring high-speed internet to every corner of Kentucky for our students, for our workers, for our small businesses, and for communities to have that kind of access that they've never had before. Lieutenant Governor Coleman's visit extended beyond the school's premises as she took the opportunity to announce nearly $170,000 to benefit Letcher County. These funds will be allocated to various projects aimed at enhancing the community's infrastructure, recreational opportunities, and tourism. Reporting from Mountaintop News, I'm Ethan Miller.